one big thing. Manute Bowles' life in the public eye began as a curiosity at the University of Bridgeport. In the pre-Twitter, pre-YouTube days, you could still be an urban legend. Manute Bowl was a seven foot six inch center from Africa who killed a lion, who blocked every shot in sight and also had a sweet tooth for three point shooting. He was actually real. He played a season for the Division II school, played in the U.S. Basketball League and then was drafted in the second round by the Washington Bullets. And it was weird how often our lives would intersect. When he was training with the Bullets, he was working out at the University of Maryland. He had this SUV with the front seat taken out. And you see this dude driving a Bronco from the back seat. Now the legend has it that in the early days in the weight room, he couldn't bench press the bar. A few years later, I'll never forget driving down Mass Avenue in DC during a protest outside the Sudanese embassy. And there's this one enormous figure towering above everyone else. It was Manute. He had a decade long run in the NBA and the sideshow antics he occasionally took part in afterwards like fighting William Perry and playing hockey were all just a means to an end to try to help raise money and awareness for his native Sudan. Strangely enough, again, as it relates to our lives intersecting, he lived in West Hartford, Connecticut for a while as I was starting my job here at ESPN. And there's not one thing that mentally prepares you for the moment you're in the bread aisle at Stop and Shop and you look up and realize, holy that's Manute Bowl. What's up, big man? Now, I'm talking about the late shot-blocking legend today because after the last two weekends of high school basketball showcases, one of the hottest names in recruiting is Bowl Bowl, son of Manute. He went off last weekend with John Calipari watching, and because I follow recruiting, the story of Cal prioritizing Bowl over some other highly regarded players has become a hot topic, and it speaks to just how good he's thought to be. The nearly seven foot two inch bowl is now considered one of the top five players in the 2018 class. And after seeing it firsthand last weekend in Indianapolis, Kentucky has offered. Even, even though he's big, like all players it seems these days, this high school junior is highly skilled. He's an awfully good three point shooter, better than 50% during this spring recruiting circuit. 